Temperature around the world is steadily increasing. This increase in temperature is a crisis that threatens life on Earth. Global warming is caused by greenhouse gases that are polluting the atmosphere and causing changes to the weather. This changes the environment around us and can lead to drought, floods, storms that cause disasters and crop failures. If we do not prevent pollution, life on Earth will become unbearable, affecting those who are less fortunate first and hitting them hardest. The Kiasa project is Africa's first clean development mechanism or CDM project registered under the Kyoto Protocol on Climate Change. It is also the world's first gold standard CDM project. The Kiasa CDM project is financed mainly from the government's expanded works program. The Department of Environmental Affairs and Tourism, through its social responsibility program, is the responsible agency. The South African Export Development Fund, which is a private sector trust, is underwriting the finance for the project's completion. Provincial government, through the Department of Housing, is also contributing. The project was originated by the City of Cape Town with technical and financial input from the NGO South South North. Cape Town's urban renewal program is helping coordinate the project while the city's Environmental Resource Management Unit is responsible for the verification and sale of the carbon credits. Implementation will happen in close consultation with the community of Kuyasa. So what makes this gold standard CDM project so significant and why has it attracted a great deal of interest from around the world? The reasons are both simple and profound. The Kyasa pilot will provide a model for sustainable energy service delivery and financing that can be applied to other low-cost housing projects. It simultaneously addresses environmental concerns, pro-poor service delivery and socio-economic development. South Africa has built around 2.5 million low-cost houses in the last 14 years. The project in Kuyasa involves just 2,300 of these Imagine the impact, socially, economically and environmentally, if all these millions of houses in South Africa were part of a similar sustainable energy initiative. Kuyase is indeed the dawning of a new era. This groundbreaking initiative is designed to offset carbon emissions through the delivery of essential energy efficient services to one of Cape Town's poorer communities. The benefits to the target community also include ongoing job creation, skills development and cost-saving mechanisms. The CDM project works by generating Carbon Emission Reduction Certificates, or CERs, that are sold to those looking to offset their carbon emissions. The credits are earned through the implementation of initiatives that use less or clean energy instead of traditional fossil-based energy. Therefore, credits are earned for every household that is fitted with a solar water geyser, insulated ceiling and energy-efficient lighting. The income from the CERs is earmarked for the operation of a community-based non-profit entity that will oversee the repair and maintenance of the existing installations, the expansion of the project to neighboring areas, as well as new initiatives that directly benefit and uplift the target community. This is truly a means by which the people of this community can bring change to their lives. How it all works the Kiyasa CDM project comprises the installation of three interventions. Firstly, the solar-powered geyser. Jangogo siya zbem zanza frigo kuko ilanga il needs. Lena yona jela yogo seben zisa elo langa. I solar water heater. I seben simbani, I seben sa amanja we langa ka. Inama tangi amabini. El tangi li mwingwe, li kupela amanzu kwe el tangi li kulu. The Elul Kuli Tangili Tata Mazi Luan is a glammy pop or in Yama Y class. A besu so a man's a pindel quel tangili cool. When I go for the end of Mana Amanda Shush. In the land of Lyo, Oza Fagelo is CDM project, the insulated ceiling. Ogo Gombatis were Gwenza in Riaco, Ipole, Shotin, Futi Besu, Ebusik. Gobayona, Ilaula, Pigisan, and Kangaleka Gobushu, Obunga Laulegi. Ubushushu yi formi energy koto soloko bufuna indawo e polile. Buya puma enli ni ebusig, bunge en enli ni shuti. I project iza kufagela i plug points ezimbini enli ni entambo zombane ezi kuselegile. Na kuinju le enju, kubalegi ilba osebenzi seyo na lena, noti le indala. Benefits the community benefits from the CDM project in the following ways. 
Access to hot water for every home involved. Lower energy costs. Lights will not draw as much power and residents can use hot water from the geyser to speed up the boiling and cooking process, thus saving energy. A more comfortable environment in the home. One that is much easier to keep warm in winter and cool in summer. Because it's not necessary to heat houses as much using paraffin or other fossil fuels, a healthier and safer environment will be created, having a marked impact on disease burden. Not just common respiratory ailments such as colds and flu, but also life-threatening TB. Safety. Wires and unnecessary plugs will be kept to a minimum. Lastly, job creation, accompanied by accredited skills development and training, and ongoing development through a sustainable source of finance. The money that is generated from the project will be used to provide maintenance and increase the scale of the installations. Izani, masi sabenzele ikamvaletu. Masi paka meni si sabenzi sana na lomkeli mgeni. Si sabenzele ukufika ingo koi. Isa zandle ni zetu basali. Si sonke, singaka ikamvali kakambileyo. Si sokela tina, sonke. Bom, 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 bom.